Maroon Creek members, now we're going to talk about in putting probably the number one most used drill on the tour. There, there isn't a guy out there that doesn't practice some form of this drill. I used to watch Tiger and a lot of them that, that practice this for hours, and you can modify it a little bit, but here's the drill. In putting, it's very important, as every shot, that you hit the ball in the center of the face. Because if you miss hit it a little bit, what happens is all of the speed in the putter head doesn't get into the ball. So putting is speed control. So when you move the putter a certain distance and it hits a ball and you watch how far it goes, the only way you can calibrate your distance is you get a feel for speed of the putter head relative to how far it makes the ball go. Now, if you miss hit the center of the face a little bit, now these new putters, I mean, this new spider, this is incredible. It's why a lot of the guys on tour are using it because there's a bigger area in the face, the MOI or where the putter face wobbles is bigger. So rather than having to hit it on a real small spot, there's more room to hit it and the face stays stable. But even so, you wanna hit it in the center of the face so that the distance relative to the speed of the putter head, you've got a good idea how to calibrate. So here's how they all do this. They set their putter down and they put a T right on the outside of the putter, maybe a quarter of an inch outside the width of the putter. And then they do it on the other side. Now, the better the putters, sometimes they put it where there's virtually no, uh, actually zero tolerance. So the putter has to go right through the tees or you hit one of the other tees. Now, when they put the ball down, at first, they put the back of the ball the back of the ball, the tees are here. They put the back of the ball right at the front of the tees. So now, and right in the middle of the tees, which is in the middle of the putter face. Now the goal is to hit the ball and not hit the tees. Now, if you hit one of the tees, you start to know what your stroke's doing. Now, a lot of these players, what they'll do is they'll move the ball back slightly. So now it's behind the teaser to the right of them, but it's right in the middle because they're gonna work on their, their follow through. So now they wanna hit the ball and have the putter go through the tees and not hit them. Some of them wanna work on their backstroke because it gets a little off. So they'll put the ball in front of the tees. So now my putter is forward of the tees. Now they're gonna make a backstroke and hit the putt and miss the tees. Now here's the next step to that drill. Almost everybody on tour, if I take this now and I move it about a putter head back, so now there's about six inches, about, about seven inches from the front. There's two or three inches behind the front, two or three inches in front of. Now, in this little box, they put the ball in the middle of the box. Almost everybody on tour, from a couple of inches behind the ball to a couple of inches past the ball, there isn't any face rotation and there isn't any arc. Now, once the putter head gets behind the tees, some arc it, some take it straight back. There's even some that go outside. The same thing on the follow through. Through this area, it's pretty square. Face is square, path is square. Once it gets outside the front tee, there's some that arc the putter around to the left, some go straight, and some even go out to the right. But through this area, there's very little face rotation and no arc in the stroke. So now you're gonna hit the ball. Now I tick this T right here. So that meant my putter head hit the ball and came a little across it, maybe a little too soon. So I'm gonna do it again. There we go. This is a very, very good way to practice your stroke. Most every tour player does it. They spend hours doing this. Just spend a little bit of time to get a sense of making sure you're hitting it solid, make sure your path doesn't have too much out to in, in to out and face rotation. You do that, you're gonna be a much better putter.